We're back to Final Fantasy VII Rebirth. I was hoping the last time we played this that we would be doing a bunch of side stuff around Cosmo Canyon. Instead, we wound up in a really long dungeon that's a trial for Red 13 that continued. We are now in the Village of the Gi, which is the race that is being held back by Cosmo Canyon or something, like their rage monsters. I really don't remember this. Turn off the power-ups. Confuse what you mean. The power ups for what? How am I doing health wise? Oh, we're all healed up. Why is there a bench here? At least I get to be Cloud this time. Alright, Yuffie. Y'all hear that just now? Our I'm not crazy, right? It's gone. Yet our spirits are condemned to linger. Outsiders such as we are unwelcome. Oh, man. Forever denied the planet's embrace. What? I feel for you. And only imagine how tough that's been. My kin now dwell within these effigies. I beseech you. Lend them your ears. Long has it been since they have had... Oh, I remember ears. fighting that dude. That dude was tough. <laughs> Did he just let out, like, a sinister chuckle when he was going away there? They're not bound to the planet, and so she rejects them. Because you have to come from the life stream to return to it. Which uh. means... These dudes can't die, right? <laughs> They're invincible! I'm not sure that's something to celebrate. Yeah, why are you so excited about that? Being stuck as spirits with no hope of release sounds like a fate worse than death. As if you know anything about dying. Uh, I mean, are you even really alive? <laughs> Another stuck spirit, perhaps? I'm going to slit your throat while you sleep. Till the materia is ours. You and me both. Okay. Okay. Okay, yeah, I heard that. So what's the big deal with this materia anyway? Oh. Okay. This is bad. Okay. Uh, let's just consider that a warm up. Yeah, I remembered what the block button was. Well, at least I hit one of them with that. Uh. Okay, I need to be able to see what I'm using. Uh, I've got something for this. Here you go. Oh, Cloud's the only one left.
Okay, we're going to do some equipment management for a moment. <clears throat> Them turning everyone to stone is not quite working out for me. Yes, I get it. Uh, ba -ba -ba. I think I've got something that does this. Pedometer pen. Wait, what? I thought... Immunity to slow and stop. Sleep. Poison. Safety bit. Yes. Do I happen to have another one? Nope. Can I make them? Or buy them? No, I cannot make them. I mean, I can make this. This is cool, I guess. Hmm. Well, I can at least keep Cloud from getting frozen. Can I buy those things? Okay, come on, move it. Nope. That, that's the only form of immunity I've got. Okay. Here we go again. Ah, oh, they interrupted me. Boy, they tried really hard there. No, not the wind current. What? Oh, I don't have to assess material on anymore. Barrett does. Okay, I gotta swap that mess back. Material and equipment, set for all. Alright. There's the assess. Swap. I want it back on cloud, please. Chakra enemy skill. I want that back. Alright. And I think I gave him... Yeah. Alright. And what did we take from... Did we take this one? Yeah, there we go. Okay. Awesome. Weird music here. that all right here we go again hit so friggin hard uh, I 
I need you to cure Cloud right friggin' now. Get away with using Greg. Jeez. back downstairs and use that save bench. I need it really badly right now. I'm going to change one more thing here, too. I have on somebody who's got it. Magnify. That's what I'm looking for. I'm going to put that on Cloud. I'm going to turn Cloud into a... Oh, he doesn't have any healing materia. Okay, we're going to have to do something about that. What a unique... Alright, I'm going to swap that with Barret. Wait. And then we'll do this. Lightning and Wind. Nope, that one needed to stay. My bad. And I'm taking this, uh, where is that magnify? There it is. This is basically the old FF7 all materia. So this will allow, if I use cure with Tifa, she'll heal everybody. Not as effective as the rest of it. But this way I've got like a mass heal option outside of Aerith Spray. Have a seat at the bench. Take a breather, fellas. You've earned it. At least this isn't a Souls-like experience where sitting at a bench respawns everything. Want me to commune with the statues? Why you gotta make it so dang hard? It's been a while since they talked to anybody. We're gonna still try to kill you, though. Materia girl. What? She is. Our ultimate salvation is cessation. It is nothingness. Our wish is not to exist, but rather to no longer exist. Where are the Ghostbusters when you need them? Well, to them it is. Hard to feel at ease around folks whose only desire is death. 
it's a fair and point. The won't let them have it. Well, who's to say they won't let the planet have it? Save uh, me! Sure. Don't you think someone I responsible can't get like over the Nita fact that that's his voice? So it doesn't fall into the wrong hands. I think we shouldn't get involved at all, Lassie. A little late for that. Yeah, right? We're like deep in the jaws of the beast now. It's a little late. What do you think he wants us to do for him? Steeped in our one desire, purest of material life, with pain and spite a lack. Steeped in our one desire, purest of material no more, with pain and spite a lack. Cloud, your brain is broken, dude. Whatever that materia is, we can't let them have it. No matter how much they want it. Don't know how far we can let this go, but for now we play along. Okay. No, sorcerer's got to go first. Uh, cure. Oh, that didn't give me near as much as I'd hoped. I'm gonna switch to Tifa for a little bit until. Aerith heals him. Oh, she was too slow! Uh-oh. 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 Oh, we're gonna die. Um... Up cloud now. That was close. About freaking time. I've defeated that group before already. I can't I can't do anything Those off stream. Born of the live stream. Like I'm in the middle of a story segment. I couldn't do anything. Can never join its flow. One cannot return to that from which one did not arise. And so our souls sought refuge here. Yet idleness brought Couldn't do it then solace. either. I was in a story segment then, too, and the goal was once I broke out of the story segment last stream, I was going to do some of these side activities on stream, even though I don't want to do those on stream. And instead, I started like a two hour long main story. Haze, a penance imposed by the planet for the sin of our existence. And now, our only wish.
wish is to be freed from this prison, to be granted true release. Uh, there's not a lot of experience to that. Please don't make me fight you again. From the planet, we claim the greatest of materia, a most sacred treasure, and imbued it with our desire for freedom. I dig whoever voice Enter acts this guy. Eternity. I love the face of his voice. The materia began to stir. And thus did we rejoice, knowing that salvation was within our grasp. We rejoiced, so convinced were we that our prayers for release had not been in vain. And then? Yet the loathsome Cetra trespassed upon our lands and stole the treasure that would grant us deliverance. Therefore, we ask that you retrieve it, the Black Materia, key to our oblivion. Please, it alone can liberate us from this endless dream. The Gi cannot rest until our sacred treasure has been restored to us. Moreover, in redressing the crime of her ancestors, the Cetra may help us to let go our ancient grudge. Where is it? It is said the orb lies within a place of Cetra worship. A place of Cetra worship? Or temple? You know what? I have an idea. At least, I think I do. Mm. Forgive me, Hollow One, if I regard you with suspicion. Now hold on there. I'm friend to one and all, thanks to my crystal ball. No matter your need, I have the right read. <laughs> He's strange, but you can trust him. Really. Huh? Alas, it appears we have been discovered. I trust you will return our materia to its rightful home. Only you can end our torment. Okay. Oh, and we're out just like that. The next morning. Uh, I guess we're back. Yeah. We need to get moving. Right. Gonna say bye to dad. I'll make you proud, dad. Yeah. Just wait. That statue was freaking cool looking though. It's good to see you again. Allow me to escort you to fellow Bugenhagen. Please, this way. Yeah, I'll, I'll go that way later. This heads back to the cave, right? Yeah, this is where we did the trial. Oh, there we go. <laughs> Hook, line, and sinker. Those undead suckers actually think we're gonna give them back their materia. Maybe we should their salvation get some distance before but you say me, something like that. It sounded more like something with the potential to wreak some serious havoc. Nope. No way in hell are we letting them have it. Can't let him have it either. Him? Sephiroth. Did no one else sense him? No. 
You're the resident expert. If you say Sephiroth was there, I'll believe you. Wait, wait, wait. So, are you saying Sephiroth's after the Black Materia too? Probably. Better to assume he is. Oh, come on! Yup! Let's, let's go! Can't let anyone get between me and my Materia! So, Kate Sith, I gotta ask, how do you know about the Cetra Temple anyway? Uh, well, like, uh... I wouldn't say I know about it, exactly. Not directly, anyway. What's that supposed to mean? I just recall some document or other discussing its existence. If we can get to a Shinra terminal, I should be able to find it again. Terminal, huh? They set any up here? I think so. I bet old Boogie will know for sure. Boogie. Alright. Now that we've finished with our excavation to the core of the planet... You might have returned to the planet. Oh, come on. We both know you didn't need to worry about me. After all, I am the son of Seto the Watcher. Forgive me. But if I recall correctly, Shinra should have set up a transmission terminal here in Cosmo Canyon. So, where is it? Oh. Uh, what did become of that thing? Ah, yes. Now I remember. I was so fascinated by the technology it employed, uh, I did some tinkering. It's some destroyed. Tinkering, I say, though it was quite a lot. But now it serves a decidedly more practical purpose. You've got to be kidding me! Oh, well, do you know about a Setra temple? A temple, you say? If you mean a place where they worshipped gods, none exist. The Setra never engaged in such practices. I didn't know that. Maybe it was referred to as such by someone ignorant of their culture. If instead it is a site of importance to the Setra that you seek, texts do speak of one, and of the pains taken to conceal it. So, it does exist? Oh, ho, ho, ho. Perhaps, though I know not where it is. Huh? And even should you find it, I would urge caution. They were a star-crossed people. To follow in their footsteps is to court tragedy. <sighs> However, the rewards may yet outweigh the risks. I don't know. He has been ever ever since we've seen him. You must bring every one of your senses to bear. For then no secret will elude you, however well hidden. And when you return home, I hope you'll share your discoveries with me. Fellow Bugenhagen! What is it? I'm a little busy here. Another man in a black robe has come. What should we do? Well now, a friend of yours? Where'd you see him? Oh, uh, the village gate. We should check it out. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Well, they will escort you to various locations around. Really? So is this a fast travel thing? Yeah, it is. It is a bit ridiculous. Blessings of the planet be upon you. Are you in need of guidance? Oh, it really is a fast travel. Okay. That's actually nice. I was really struggling to find my way around this place. Nanaki. Is this man okay? He is. Does he I'll look be okay? Week. Not sure why though. I know Mako poisoning when I see it, and this isn't it. Nebo. 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 Ain't that? Ratifa and I grew up. Oh, of course. Nibelheim has a terminal. I'd bet my whiskers on it. Oh, boy. It, uh, had a terminal. Cloud, remember when you told Gee an attack back there? That I might be weird, but you can trust me. Hey, well, even if you were lying, I'm going to prove to you that you can trust me. That I'm on your side. It's not that. Hmm. Hmm? 
We should go. <laughs> Wait, you're talking about heading to Nibelheim from here? There's no roads you can take, far as I know. Maybe Good thing there's a plane. Land. But by air. Meaning we'll need smoke. Right then, back to the airstrip we go. Oh boy. What, Chadley? Yeah, okay, whatever. Shut up. Oh. Now the world opens up. I was friggin' waiting for that to happen for like two and a half streams. Okay. There is one thing I'm gonna do real quick, though. You may now face off against Bahamut Arisen, a winged being possessed of phenomenal powers of destruction. I encourage you to pit your skills against this summoned entity so that I might complete its materia. All right, we already looked at that crap. We gon' die! Okay. Too bad. Not yet. Uh, touch. I feel like I did this before. Using synergy skills or synergy abilities will crush run. Okay. Ah. Uh. I, need, I really need to block that crap, not try and roll away from it. have enough I've got enough for this okay
Okay, uh, we gotta do this. Gotta block that mess. Good to know. Uh oh. Okay, let's go. Let's go. You willing to step up for us? Frankly, I'm surprised I've survived so far. Can you take over? Take it over. Give me a friggin... Giga Flare? Oh, I have done this before. Uh, protect. Shell. Go on Tifa. Wait, why didn't that pick them up? Heal everybody. Stay strong and carry on. Woo! 
What a recovery. Okay. Let's go. No, that's a bad idea. Don't overdo it. I got it. Ooh. Didn't see that one coming. Bad timing. Okay, come on. Let's go. First full strength summon I've defeated. Just like that, okay? Ooh. Bahamut Arisen has fallen. Well done. I had no idea the God of Destruction could evolve further, but I now suspect it could surpass even these limits. With this crimson terror at your command, I almost pity anyone who is foolish enough to try and stand in your way. I pity the fool. I look forward to seeing what you... Wait, Cloud has a materia. Why would it not let me use it? Discoveries you make in your travels. Hey! <laughs> What do we got? We got side quests! Maybe. There we go. Portents of a calamitous ruin have been sighted in the Vale of late. Dreadful fiends whose very presence heralds doom. Blah, blah, blah. It has been entirely too long since I've done some old-fashioned field work. I seem to have misplaced my tools. What? There's no point lamenting choices, Miss. Okay. I've already played this. Okay. Um, uh, how to find my way around this friggin' place? I just want to go to the vendor. How do I get to the vendor? What the? 
Cool. I hope that wasn't someone's materia, because it's mine now. If only I too could fight forest fires. Okay. Aha! Here we go. Weapon vendor, you got anything cool for me? Oh, I've seen worse. Congrats. You're welcome to shop here. Thanks. It's so nice when when you're very selective about your clientele. Don't you dare use my weapons for anything unsavory. All right. The history of Magnata books can be traced back. Oh boy, it has been a while since we've done this. Finishing touch. Evoke the power of a raging cyclone. Cool! Ah, I can do this offline. May the planet bless you with wisdom. Okay. No other store has this many books dedicated to planetology. Please get out of my way. You heard it. Tonics, liniments, filters. We have everything you need to cure what ails you. Okay, you all right, dude? Dude sounds like he was about to barf up a lung. Okay. That's the end. And then... I saw it on the map. Where is it? I have to take an elevator to get there? I should have used one of the guides to find my way around. Well, I think I'm leaving the town right now. Yeah. I most certainly am. Uh, actually, no. One of the guides is down there. Let's talk to him. See if we can uh, get to where we're trying to go. Why can't anything just be a straight route around here? These murals are cool looking though. They give me like a God of War vibe. Blessings of the planet be upon you. Are you in need of guidance? Okay. Yeah, just give me a flat plane with everything immediately around me. Uh, what are you doing? Nothing much. Preparing for field work. Haven't performed any in quite some time. At the moment, I'm trying to hunt down my tools. I must have buried them awfully well. But where? Well, you're the one who can friggin' float wherever you want. Rage? Yeah, I don't know. Maybe you ought to let us handle it. Don't treat me like I'm some invalid. I'm the very picture of health. What I mean? Just swallow your pride and let us take care of whatever it is. You stay and rest. <sighs> well, I suppose I should pick you up on the offer while you're still here. 
Very well. I'll let you assist me. Oh, how kind. Good. Now, lay it on us. No, he he cracked his back. In truth, something has been troubling me as of late. Take a look at this field report from my previous survey of the life springs in our local region. Are you sure this is accurate? It was at one point, but life springs are mutable. They rarely remain in one location for long. Indeed, such events move periodically. Nothing unusual about that in the least. However, it is not their positions which trouble me. Rather, what the survey team has reported. Perhaps this fact-finding expedition of ours will clear things up. I would have you visit this site first. There, measure the Marco frequency using this meter of mine. All right. Oh, we'll do. Hey. Oh no. Okay. I mean, at least that's a marking on a map. I. It's not like that. Here's a picture. Find a place in the picture. No, I'm gonna take this now. I chose this place because it was close to where I thought I needed to go. Oh, I did complain. I looked them up. Remember that one with the dude that gave Barrett the gun? He needed that, like, blue ore, and I just gave up and looked it up. Like this? Well, it won't let me pull it up while I'm on the elevator, but... What they just gave me is a marking on a map. I can find that, I think. No, not talking to you. Wait. Is there no way out of here? Oh, okay, there we go. Okay, then this way. Good, now we're finally getting to the other side quest. No, they you talk about ill omens when good things are happening. Yes? Forgive me. I've yet to introduce myself. I am Caesar, one of the canyon's mentors. Now then, to answer your question, rather vile fiends have been sighted in the Vale. Ones believed to be portents of collapse. Like, they're just showing a section of the scorpion's tail, but when it looks like that on its own, it looks like a, a metapod with a horn. Amethyst ruin. And I don't even really? play Pokemon. The creatures have been observed on many occasions in times long since past. But always has our planet risen to the challenge, brought her might to bear and staved off disaster. It is through this unique celestial event that the planet provides us with proof of her victory. As you can see from these photographs, once the cataclysm has been averted and our world stands triumphant, gloriously resplendent comets grace the heavens. Huh. Something about these like hats makes me think they should be carrying bags. Indeed. Though it should be said that none of these pictures were taken close by but rather far from our current location. Perhaps we simply cannot see the mirror. These are the here. ones that piss me the off. The falling stars may have left their marks in the skies elsewhere. We're gonna go look for them, right? If, if you, you mean I'm gonna look them up, answer. yes. Truly? You would do this for us? It would be a great weight off our shoulders were you to find them. 
If you are serious, I suggest visiting the three locations in which the fiends were last seen. The signs we seek may show themselves there. Here, use these okay. reference materials and this recording instrument. What? Photograph the comets you spot, though try to ensure your pictures match ours. Blessings of the planet be upon you. If you're getting a picture of a comet, you'll take whatever friggin' picture I can get you. Don't get picky. Comet. Oh, I didn't frame the shot right. I guess I'll just have to wait for another comet. Okay. No. I already beat you. Alright, let's take the elevator down. I think. I know there's one more Queen's Blood player here. That's specifically what I'm looking for. Well, I mean, doing the side quest things is just kind of a, a side benefit. Yeah, over here. I need to find this. here again I don't know how to get wait I mean it's pretty close to the end how did I not find that no 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 we're not taking the elevator again oh this place is so difficult to find your way around I mean, at least I feel like I'm starting to get a feel for it. Okay, we're headed straight there. I was here! How did I miss that? Is that SSL? SSL? Used to be a soldier. Lots of hand signals. That's how Shinra's oh. sign language came to be a thing. I know the basics. Queen's blood, huh? All right, here we go. Ah, oh, that's not what I wanted. This is a dangerous placement. I'm going to pass this turn. Risky move, but I'm taking it. That's what I was waiting for. What? Oh crap, he's got cards that get stronger when they're destroyed too. got two of them. This Mind Flayer build is not going to work out for me. Mm -hmm. 
That'll destroy the Mind Flare. So I could place this here. Let's do that. In the match. Game's over. Easy peasy. Destroy an allied card and replace it. Okay. So that's one of those replacement cards. I like it. Hang on. Are you ex military too? That when you've got SSL, so you can open a secure communication with any Solid website. Idea. Good luck with that. Hashtag tech nerd. Excuse me for a moment, please. All right, here is your bean. Guess the luck couldn't keep rolling too much. Carolina Reaper. <laughs> Running an AC. What you talking about, Willis? Be upon you. Are you in need of guidance? All right, let's get out of here. There are wanted posters for them all over Oh. Ooh. No, this is the wrong way. Yeah. Okay. Still can't do that. <sighs> Um, if I go to the airstrip, is it going to force me to the next area? I'm going to save just in case. Whew. Okay. Not that you've got a choice, but thank you for choosing Bronco Airlines. <laughs> my friend, you couldn't give us a lift to Nibelheim, could you? Well, no. We're not too far, I reckon. The old girl should be more than up to the challenge. Oh, thank goodness. We are cleared for takeoff. Appreciate the business. Okay. He is Sid. Does that mean you're going to fail to stand and have a seizure on the floor?
Uh, yeah, I'll play this. Ooh. Oh, that bean is still hitting me, man. Oh, I don't think so, Chief. Oh, no. I played this wrong. No! I just lost. go here. Good. I was hoping Midgard Stormer would show up. This is risky. I don't know why I'm why I'm like humoring this. Let's try This was the backwards deck. Let's try this one. need two crystalline crabs here. This is like a straight up synergy deck. to mm. that. Careful, or I'm going to close myself off here. Let's do that. And now he's going to take that bottom slot. Dang it.
Whoa. Dang it! At least they don't make me sit through, like, the whole, like, here's the part where you lost over and over again. Let's try this one. Yeah. Let's leave Midgard Stormer out of this and this. Okay. This is starting oddly. I don't think this deck's gonna win it for me. It may be a bit of a defeatist attitude, but I feel like that Synergy deck was working better for me the way this is laying out right now. Like, all of these require three to play. I can't play anything. Yeah, this, that was terrible. Let's go with that last deck again. Because I feel like I had the best shot with that. Yeah, I just don't want to put together a new deck right now. But yeah, I, d I did think about that as well. hoping you would do that. I was not hoping you would do that. Protect that one spot there. Yes, keep enhancing your own cards. Ooh, this is dangerous to play. I'm doing it anyway. Now he's going to take the bottom row and he's going to win. That was so close, though. I had the right idea. I just played it dumbly. Yeah, so the goal in this one is definitely... Synergies. I don't need two of those. No, I mean, like, the the best use of this deck. I'll put it that way instead. Yes. That's exactly what I was hoping for. this here.
And that's the end. Let's see what he can what he can do with that. So rude. Did he just weaken Dio? He did! edit this deck and get rid of some of this stuff. Um, Mithril Golem is not helpful. He doesn't play into synergies. What does this one do? Ifrit's good. Would be nice to see him. Let's get rid of you. You're not that helpful because he doesn't destroy anything. Let's get rid of the security officer. Okay. Destroy an allied card and replace it. That's not bad. I'm going to put that in. Replace an ally and lowers the power on affected ally and enemy cards. Okay, that's a good front rank card. I need synergy cards, though. cards are played raises power by one so that's that should synergize oh I'm never gonna have a friggin I'm never gonna have that many three spots no first time this card is enhanced free the power. yes yes that's an that's an excellent synergy card okay when enemy cards are destroyed, that's a good one too. Because he's got a replacement deck. So that counts as destroying an enemy card. First Enfeebled. When allied cards are destroyed, that would be good for a different... For my Mind Slayer deck. We'll put Zemlet in. Alright. I think this is a better, a slightly better synergy deck. Let's save that for later. We'll save that for later. That's what I was hoping for. Let's go. Deathclaw goes down next. Yeah, worried about that. Uh, he went straight up the middle this time. Stupid. 
destroy an allied card and replace it. That'll get me back in the game. I can play is this one. Oh, this replaces an ally. not going to win. Um, I don't think there's anything I can do to win. Yeah, I've already lost. This deck felt good, though. Like, I think if he hadn't gone up the middle, I'd have been fine. Not Titan. Not this yet. Dude, gotta give me some time to set up my gambit. First time this card is enhanced. Okay. So then, let's do this. Okay. This isn't going the way I want it to. Put Ifrit down. Okay, so that'll enhance this card. Bam. Now I lose that. There's Dio. Destroy it. Replace an ally and lower the power on the affected tiles by the replaced ally's power. Okay, that doesn't matter because I'll get this spot back. Okay. Can't play anything. Can't play anything. That was an odd choice of card to play. Don't take that center back. Oh, you turkey. Yes! I 
I like that synergy deck. Tell me more about the Shadow Blood Queen. What? Did I open the door? Kingdom I Hearts. Have the stories. The warnings. It is an abomination. Can't stop shaking. I have to destroy this card. I know that, but still, I... Therapy, dude. Therapy. <laughs> it's too late now. She will not be denied. Hey. Malfunction. Malfunction. Abnormal levels detected. Running search. Complete. Levels confirmed to be a match for Queen's Blood creator, Ladrell Belmont. Conducting follow-up search. Two hits. Mr. Belmont's obituary and a voice recording by the reporter who discovered the body. Preparing voice recording. I'm currently standing outside the home of Lidrell Balmon, the famed creator of Queen's Blood. Now let's hope he's willing to answer a few questions for us. Uh, what's this smell? It's awful. What, you didn't even knock? You just walked in? Mr. Balmon, are you home? Oh my god. Is dead. How long has he been in here? It must have been ages. His body is. The results of the autopsy reveals the cause of death to be starvation. The state in which he was found suggests that he had been playing Queen's Blood without stopping to eat, drink, or sleep. I found numerous cards scattered on the floor around him. And. Hold on. What's this? That card. It looks like the ship. The recording breaks up after that. As it so happens, Mr. Belmont was in possession of the world's one and only Shadow Blood Queen card. However, the card was not found in his home, leading to theories that the reporter who discovered the body stole it. The reporter in question subsequently went missing. Yeah, right? Yeah. Version updates required to secure path to world domination. Thank you very much for playing with me. Okay. All right. Back to the airstrip. Defeating that dude was the whole reason I came here. Got like an eyelash stuck you in. You rang? Ugh. Prepare to be razzled and dazzled. <laughs> I love how it said that later. Like, excuse me, you interrupted me. Okay. We've got a side quest thingy up here. Oh. Uh-oh. Ill omen 12 o'clock. Yeah, right? 
This is one of the things the priest asks us to look for. He looks pissed. What do we got? Dealing enough damage with ice will pressure them. Following up with fire will leave them open. Okay, whatever. I'm just gonna straight up kill it. That's alright with you, game. Okay. Can't even get near the dang thing. You can't even be within this thing's hitbox while it's doing that. So of course she heals herself. Laser Queen, go! I love the way she says that, like, um, excuse me. Alright, try to recreate the planetologist photographs with at least 80% accuracy. Although Caesar will accept any picture you offer. That's nice. Right. Okay, so I feel like it was taken from a vantage point of, like, over here. I mean, that's pretty good, right? Maybe let's zoom in a little more. Oh, do I have to get the comet in it? Hold on. Let's see if it shows up again. Gotcha. Did you even look at the photos they gave us? What are you talking about? Yeah, I'm happy with this picture. Well, What's your problem? Well, maybe you ought to add a photographer to your resume. <laughs> What's with that shade you just threw spots. me? Like, the only thing she didn't do was groan at me. Just like, ugh. Did you even look? All right, what's this? Uh... All right, 7200 is what I'm going for. Let's do it. And I gotta remember, in this game, down is down, up is up. Oh, 
Ah! You're not helping, Rocket! Oh, 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 oh no. This is great! Because I forgot, you've got to do that dive. Like, I need to preserve as much... Thanks. I've got to preserve as much altitude as I can for that dive down there. As I immediately dive. Come on. And then here. Ah, I've lost too much! No, I... Why? I don't understand. Like, you literally just need to, like, dive straight down and then climb out of this it. But great. it wouldn't let me do it. Now I remember why I skipped this one. as you can. And then dive. Up. There we go. Wait, how was I supposed to get 3600? I hit everything. Wait, what? Oh, that oh. wasn't the end of the freaking course. I just assumed it was because the 500 was on the ground. Uh. Uh. Oh. Hold on. Oh, it keeps going. Wait, how do you... Oh, you have to hit that air current after the 500. That's how the course continues. Giddy up, girl! Okay. Clearly visible from the start of the course. And I'm just like, oh, Where do I go? Well, it's Yuffie who rides the chocobo, so... And here comes another dive. There we go. And then the shenan shenanigans start all over again. Oh, what? the chocobo to do what you want you should have established a bond with apony before heading out you've got to be on the same page when you're running a course be completely in sync you don't say then why don't you a real jockey show us how it's done i can't believe you people 
I'm going home. Ah, oh, crap. That certainly got fired. Yeah, yeah. No need to rub it in. Come on. Let's this tough love thing's not working. Maybe you should try a different strategy. Yeah? Well, your chocobo thinks you're a piece of crap. Excuse me a moment, please. Take them. All right. Let's keep going. I definitely don't want to get locked into any new story segments right now. So that way I can take care of some of these things offline. Assuming I don't get... Continue getting friggin' hooked on Supermarket Simulator. Appany, what are you doing? Why are you still following me? You know I can't run. No, they're you following me. I'm following you. Appany, I'm sorry, but I can't. I just can't. Says who? You just watch. I'm gonna prove to you that there's no other bird that can fly like Apony. I will. Boy, if Yuffie really wanted to rub it in, she'd be like, she'd call it by the wrong name. There's no other bird like a pony. to hold R2! <laughs> oh, You'll never make it as a jockey if you can't. Shut up! I'm gonna make you Shut up! I'm like, dude, why am I plummeting like this? Okay. Giddy up, girl. Okay. So this time I'm going to do it when they're right in the middle. Bam. Just like that. Big dive. Ah, oh, I dove underneath it. Again. Hold on, we're trying again. We're trying again. Too early. This is great. I have to be careful because both the left and right sticks can make you dive. So, like, while I'm trying to adjust the camera, it still kind of screws with my angle a bit. Alright, here we go. Now I 
pulled up a little too late before, so dive. Now. Ah, oh, way too early. And that time I didn't dive far enough. I think I screwed myself up on that one from the very beginning of the dive. There's a mini game in uh, Final Fantasy XIV that this makes me think of. It's called uh, Air Force One in the Gold Saucer. All right. Big dive. There we go. Huh? How'd I lose all that altitude? Was I not holding up long enough? I like that Yuffie takes a deep breath before she takes off, just like that moment to collect herself. Thought I cut that a little too tight. Glad that worked out. And dive. Pull up. All the way up. There we go. And dive. Up, all the way up. Um, how does this work? Oh. Oh no. Come on, get caught up in it, get caught up in it. No! At least we did it, kinda. You see me? This bird it. needs a friggin' throttle. And it's all thanks to this chocobo, Apony, the best of the best. Don't you think I know that? There's something on your mind. Just say it. The day I fell, I just, I got overconfident. Figured I had the race in the bag. Been there I many, many times. About all the ways I was going to spend the prize money. I wasn't focused. But when I was rounding the final corner, Apony and I, we got out of sync. Before I knew it, I was in the dirt. Apony jumped in front to try and protect me. And because of that, she got herself hurt. <laughs> so I, I just can't get back in the saddle. I can't. What if I hurt her again? I'd never forgive myself. You're up, Mr. Merc. Put those chocobo interpreting skills to work. Huh? It was a terrible accident. But we've learned from that experience and can grow as chocobo and rider and strive to not repeat past mistakes once we've healed shani let's i love how apony keeps just chirping in the background apony you buy that <laughs> how shani got her mojo back Until then, mind looking after her for me? Uh, you serious? 
Well, yeah. She still needs exercise, and I won't be able to take her out for a while. I feel better knowing she's in the hands of a rider I can trust. I'm sorry for making you worry, Mom. I promise I won't give up. Not again. At least, not <sighs> until the next I accident. Be warned, when I'm healed up, you're going down. <laughs> Bring it on! Okay. No, we are not going to try glide to Chocobo. Alright. We're going to be stopping there for the evening. <laughs>